I, I gotta go. Uh, can I help you? Yeah. I called about the job. Yeah, I heard y'all niggas is hiring. What's up? There's no jobs for manager. It's just for counter. Good. I'm looking for the least possible amount of responsibility. Mr. Huff, Mr. Giner is ready for your interview. Actually, we'll be interviewing as a team. We're here to fuck shit up. <clears throat> uh, let me just move this. We're all in this together. And I wanted to put across the general idea rather than the details. Like, people get all hung up on details. Like, what school did I go to? How many organs did I get? Could be like six, could be none. It's not important. What is important is that I am, yes? Very interesting. Um, I see your hobbies are drinking, smoking weed, and all types of ill shit. Yeah. On your resume under activities, you have smoking blunts with the homies and busting caps in whitey. Qualifications. Rape, murder, arson, and rape. You said rape twice. I like rape. Do you have any special skills? Oh, yes. I do. I, I do voices. What are your skills, girls? Oh, we can dance. <laughs> you mean like dancing? We're really good dancers. Yes! We've come to this planet looking for intelligent life. Oops, we made a mistake. We're happy to be in America. Don't ask for a green card. <laughs> I want you in the worst way. Mr. Masuhisu. Matsu. Masi. Matsu Moto. Moto. Martha, can I call you Martha? No, you may not. Okay. Uh, human resources lady. Oh, oh you I know, think... it, it's actually, it's Pam. I'm sorry. Well, Pan. No, my name is Pam. Are you saying Pan or Pam? I'm saying Pam. Yeah, I'm sorry, who is this gentleman sitting behind you? Hello, Ms. Lady. I have fast food experience. <laughs> yeah, like 20 years ago. Do you have any experience? No, sir, I have no experience, but I'm a big fan of money. I like it. I use it. I have a little. I keep it in a jar on top of my refrigerator. I'd like to put more in that jar. That's where you come in. Have you had experience? With what? Women's clothes. What the fuck would I be doing in women's clothes? Do I look like a transvestite? Do you drive an automobile? Mm. With or without the boot? We're not generally comfortable in an office setting, I would say. I get cooped up. Not so task-oriented. Not a workhorse. I also get headaches from computers, so I can't be around them for too long. I take stuff. If you're looking for a Clydesdale, I'm probably not your, your man. We're slow learners, and we're not particularly good listeners. That'll be, uh, that'll be a huge problem. We're also slow learners. What's your policy on Columbus Day? Well, uh, we, we work. Really? The guy discovered the new world. Nobody in this town works without a retainer, guys. You think you can find somebody who does, we tell you you have my blessing. But I think we all know that person's not going to represent you as well as I can. Will, our offer is $84,000 a year. Retainer! Retainer. Let's do this, you know, you guys are hired, you're in, you know, unless you're like the weirdest guys ever and I don't see it. Great. Was that a fart? I don't know. I can taste it. On my tongue. I thank you for your time. Actually, sir, I really need this job to impress a girl. Will you leave now, please? Please leave this office. We're done with this interview. Do we get any sort of souvenir? Get out of my office! Hey, we tried, right? Thanks a lot. Yeah. Get my resume. Congratulations. You got yourself a job. Right on, huh? <laughs>